So the, my most recent extract is complete and I'm going to download it. So you can see that it's downloaded here. Now, if you haven't used SSID extracts before, because it's the best mechanism to mass input newly acquired SSIDs in your sys, you can still use the extract to view SSIDs. So you want to go to the CalPads user manual or have it bookmarked. And then under resources, you have batch file templates. And so you're going to scroll down and you see the SSID extract template. It's an Excel file. And this template was made specifically to import into your student information systems and to match students who don't have SSIDs to newly acquired SSIDs. After we enable the editing and enable content, all we have to do is we're going to overwrite. So we're going to want to go into the first cell that we can input data and click import extract file and know where your extract went. Mine goes to downloads. And here's the demo test. You can see it down here. This is my extract open and it imports all the data in here, okay? And so let's talk a little bit about what you're looking at if you're unfamiliar. This file, you can save it and import it into your student information system, and it should be an automatic matching of SSIDs. However, if that's not your normal process and you hand identified SSIDs, notice that I had only four past records, but I have a whole host of SSIDs, right? And look at the various different start dates. So some of these students started in August, pretty much most of them. And so that goes to show that your date range is looking for active enrollments on that date. So if you want to see the newly assigned SSIDs, column O, date SSID was created, is where you're going to want to look. And if you just click data, filter, click the down pointing chevron, and then sort Z to A. It's the same as saying high to low or most recent as far as the date is concerned. You can see that all the SSIDs created today are listed at the top. And so these are your new students. These are the uh, representative of the file you just submitted. Okay. Previous functionality, you can do a batch file extract and as far as right now, that's not available, but this is how to be efficient and how to maximize uh, the assignment of your SSIDs through an extract as you pull them up. You can see that the next date was yesterday and so on and so forth. So understand what you're going to get in the extract and understand how to use it. The purpose is to import SSIDs from CalPads into your student information system. However, it can also be used to individually verify matches. So you can see the assignment of SSIDs, the student's name, 